The Gordon Stakes is next then, and there's a lot of mile and a half races this week, and yet this one has still managed to get 20 odd runners, so not quite sure what that is, but it's a mile and a half, and the top one is Room for Mistakes for Leon Van Rensburg, Getaway Junkie, Graham Clutterbuck, Tides Out, Ryan Tamasili, Weapon of Yesero, Darren Thompson, Cincinnati Raven, Vinnie Gerrard, Cruise on by Craig Beckwith, Dazaki Loma for Craig Allen, Generic Barn for Satyam, and Transfit Turk for Ryan Costello are going to have real trouble from those draws. Weiner, Thomas Rogers, Alfonso the Great, Paul Rhodes, DJ Dan, David Hooley, Fight Without Fear, Leon Van Rensburg, Francesca Kamani, Dan Hughes, Locking Up Cheetah, David Robertson, Raynell Sailor, Alex Ince, Royal Correspondent, Jim Murray, Satko Durst, Steve Rand, Duchess of Epsom, Paul Rhodes, Jupiter Rain, Craig Allen, Kill Shenny, Glance, David Robertson, and Legend and Sugar in a Plum for Joshua Sullivan. So 23 of them then right across the track here and away they go and who's going to get to the all important rail it seems to be important to get there today legend and sugar and a plumber out quickly but they're both wide on the track and they're going to try and get far enough in front of they can cut across and it looks like they've managed to do that transfixed turk and generic barn didn't manage to do it another one that didn't manage to get across was fight without fear so we'll see how that affects the end of the race then but it's legend and sugar and a plum who are disputing the lead early from getaway junkie who's behind them in third then comes royal correspondent and alfonso the great and the cruise on boys also up in that leading group as well and as we switch angles you can see that it's still legend and sugar and a plum first and second getaway junkie is third and then in fourth place is Royal Correspondent. These ones closest to us are going to lose some ground on this turn. You can see Generic Barn in the yellow. Also there is the uh, Rain Elf Sailor in the purple and green. Also one of David Robertson's is stuck wide as well. I think that's Lopping Up Cheetah. And Weapon of Yesero is also going to need to look for a bit of a bit of room. So too is uh, Francesca Kamani and tides out but they're making their way towards that turn now and that's when we'll see how the complexion of the race changes but it's legend in the lead then by a good two and a half lengths in now there you can see it look at that that um generic barn just went right down to last as they took that turn so generic um barn is the back marker then but legend is in front legend is the leader from sugar and a plum and getaway junkie then kill shanny glance he's coming through with a run the one that is coming up now is room for mistakes that's making a bit of a forward move raw correspondent and cruise on by still there as well so cincinnati raven jupiter rain is now coming around the outside with a dangerous looking run but they've got to get to legend legend is still in front Kill Shenny glances second. Sugar in a plums trying to run around again on the inside. Room for mistakes is there as well. So is Jupiter Rain tides out trying to get into it. Fight without fear has got itself into a decent position now as well. But it's Legend who's still in the lead. Room for mistakes is second. Then comes Kill Shenny glance and Jupiter Rain fight without fear and Sugar in a plum. They're coming down towards the final furlong and a half. Legend is still in the lead, but Room for mistakes and Jupiter Rain are closing with every stride. After that one, Kill Shenny glance fight without fear. Dutchies and Epsom's trying to get into it as well. It's still Legend though from Room for mistakes and. Legend is still in front. Room for mistakes is coming through. Now with the right one on his duties and Epsom. Dazaki Loma also sweeping into it now as they race up towards the line. Dazaki Loma has taken it on the line. Dazaki Loma is the winner. Duties and Epsom. Legend sugar and a plum. Cruise on by after that. And quite a few never got into that race at all. Really far too big a feel for that race. I can't understand why it was such a big feel when there's so many more and a half races this week. But Dazaki Loma has taken it and for Craig Allen from stall number three, legend for Joshua Sutherland was second from stall number 11, that could have crossed quite well, Duchess of Epsom, Paul Rhodes was third, that came out of stall one, Sugar in a Plum fourth for Joshua Sutherland out of 19 and fight without fear for Leon Van Brinsburg out of 18 and that was really wide early on so maybe if it had been a straighter race or a few less runners that one would have got a bit closer but you can see down the bottom there, Loppy Not Cheetah, Francesca Camani, Raynell Sailor, Transfect to generic barn never really had a chance at all, did they? <laughs>